Hello, and welcome back to Heidi Einvar's story. I'm Fire Nation, and this is Project Zomboid. Good day, everybody. It is bright and early for Heidi and myself. Now, I've been looking at the map quite a lot, and I think we might have some stuff down south that could be beneficial to us. Also, I kind of want to clear this sector before heading up here. Maldrock just seems like a lot of houses and a big strip of semi-decent shops that could come in handy. I, I really don't know. I haven't been here long enough, but I think we could maybe get some beneficial items out of the south sector because north, as we've been seeing, is just a hellhole. <laughs> a complete hellhole. There's so many zombies up there. So I think I'm going to hit this road and continue south down it. Oh, I also brought some hunting knives with me. I have a bunch of them and I am out of short blunt weapons. Oh boy. I also really need to get better about checking the zombies. I need beta blockers. I wonder if it's something just in the code, like every survivor's panic's a little bit different. Some get more than others. Because I swear I've had survivors, like Federico, he didn't really get panicked at all. What was his character? God, there's just so many. He was a construction boy. Yeah. I don't remember having too many problems with panic on him, but I also had like 10 bottles of beta blockers when I died. I was just never using them. It might not be long enough into survival where Heidi's become... What was that? It sounded like a bull. Where uh, Heidi's become de desensitized to slaughtering all of her neighbors. <laughs> Alright, so yeah, I have been down here. Let me check our map real quick one more time. Okay, yeah, so we are going. This is going to curve. Yep. Also, one of the most annoying things I have about recording is the lighting. Oh, boy. And I hope that I've fixed it and positioned all my lights correctly and that there's no more black fuzzies going on. It is such a pain. Every day I turn on OBS, it's different. <laughs> Move the lightings around, get everything just perfect to record. So hopefully I have alleviated that issue. Ah, jeez. There's just as many zombies down here. Alright, well, this is probably where these guys have been floating towards my base. From. Because honestly, we're just down the street. So taking these guys out is pretty good. I also might have to move homes because I've almost depleted every water source in that place. And you gotta have water where you live. That's just a necessity. No. <laughs> you will not grab my ankles, good sir. A lot of nothing. Beta blockers usually pop up on the top. Annotated map. We'll take that. Let's give it a little cheeky read. This is for Rosewood. Okay, not Louisville. When they come and they will, take what you can, carry, and disappear into the forest. Left bug out stuff here. Okay, cool. So we have somewhere other than Louisville. If we ever end up there, we have a little questy for a bug out bag to go grab. Ooh, is that another hunting knife? Man, there's just so many. Might as well make good use of my beta blockers that I have active, huh? Yeah, get some skill leveling going on. Nothing. 
Oh, it was a bread knife. I also kind of want to clear this area so I can get my forage on, because if we cannot find axes, I'm going to have to make them. I need that axe skill. That's what uh, Heidi is. She's a lumber woman. Oh yeah, the crunchies. Yeah, no beta blockers. Hopefully I have my uh, loot category set right so that medicine and stuff will appear at the top. <laughs> Otherwise, I could just be missing it all. Golly. <gasps> Flamingo party. Oh, my God. Okay. Um, yeah, let's continue down this road. Man, if I could find like a McCoy's logging truck or a or a. What are those? The fire trucks, the fire searching. Whoa. That's a little bit of a find right there, huh? Thought you were a lot closer to me. Oh boy. We angered the lot of them. That's a hunting knife. Oh yeah, juicy. Juicy. Oh, yep, there it is. Not the best condition, but that's all right. Okay, what else was in this bad boy here? We do not have a lug wrench. We have a wrench. Take the twine, the twain, and the empty bottle. Nothing in the plastic bag. Maybe I should hop in this. Yeah, a whole lot of nothing. Ma'am. Ma'am. Is that a hand fork? Yeah, I thought I could hear somebody coming from behind. Squishy. I do not think I've read the Riverside map, so let's pop that up real quick. And uh, we can return it to its owner. Just so we can get that area uncovered. I am seriously considering moving out of Maldraw. I don't think I'll ever start here again. This place sucks. My normal go-tos are obviously Rosewood and Riverside. Is that a pipe? That is a pipe. And I know quite a lot about them and where to get good loot and stuff, so it makes it really easy. But I do enjoy getting out of my comfort zone in this game. I do enjoy a struggle. It makes it more uh, worthwhile when you finally... Oh, and it's a lead pipe. When you finally do get the stuff that you need, you know? So rewarding. But at the same time, this place just suck. Oh. Damn, you have a nice mustache, sir. My compliments. I was also thinking about another game to play for the channel. Maybe just release them three a week, Monday, Wednesday, Friday. Let me know if that'd be something you'd be into. Maybe uh, Oxygen Not Included, Don't Starve, Terraria. Be 
But yeah, those are just some of the games that I already have in my library. People seem to really like them. And they are easier to record. Like, Project Zomboid was one of my main go-tos because... A, it's my favorite game, but B, it's isometric, so it's a lot easier to record and edit because the file sizes aren't absolutely gigantic. Like, an hour of this gameplay would be like four to five gigabytes of footage. Now, if I were to do the same on the same resolution and everything on Subnautica, it's going to be like 10 or, or higher because there's a lot more movement, a lot more texture, rendering, and all that. Yeah, let me know. I might do a poll, community poll. Zomboid will always be a staple, though. Don't you worry about that. Zomboid is not going anywhere. Because Heidi and I are going to make it to winter. We're going to stock up on shotgun shells, and we're going to annihilate Louisville and maybe set some things on fire. I'm gonna have to test the fire. <laughs> I'm gonna have to test it in a solo game on a different character. Just to see if my PC can handle that. I do not want to get backed into that other group. Oh, that was actually a mouse bump. Did not mean to swing there. Just digital watches. Okay. Yeah, I think we're just gonna keep going south. Check some of these houses out. Clear this area out. And then it, and then at least we can say we cleared most of the southern section of Muldricky. Get these guys out of here. I still do want to build a wall in the gate and live in the gated community, but ah, there's just nothing here. If I can't find carpentry books, that ugh, the skill grind without the books sucks. I'll just say that much. Wow. Let's see if we can just get a couple of these guys aggroed over. What is our sneak snock skill at? It's only one. Yeah, I haven't been doing a lot of sneak snocking. Our short blunt's about to hit level four. Oh, big whiff. open window there. I do not think I've been down here. Not to these houses, at least. I'm trying to aggro that dude, too. Come on. The hammer of justice! 1 p.m. Maybe we ought to think about going back and resting and th that's what a coward would say. Oh, Heidi's an animal. Oh, just in time. Got the squishy. Yeah, here, come on, zombies. Line up. Step right up and get your head knocked off by the hammer of justice. It does not discriminate. Step right up, sir. You're in luck. You know, I thought by playing on high population, I would have more chances of getting good loot off zombies, but that is just not the case. It's a whole lot of nothing. Plenty of clothes to take apart for tailoring, which I haven't really been doing a lot of. I mean to, but I haven't been doing a whole lot of playing offline. Oh, 
Okay. I think we're finally clear to get into this place. Nice, uh, bloody window entrance here. All right. Plenty of water in there. Fresh egg carton. Well, I'll throw that in the freezer. Just in case we're ever in this neck of the woods and the power hasn't gone out yet. Speaking of which, I'm surprised it hasn't. Spatulas. Eh, I don't need the canned peas. I don't need them. Oh, I do not like the layout of this place. Very tight quarters. Another bedroom. God. Tailoring one. I've already read that. All right. Let's get out of here. Let's have a quick peep at the map real quick. Where are we? So that might be a garage down south of us, which could be good. There's also a lot of zombies down that way. I should have probably rested in that house. Oh, I, I think we'll be all right. There's not too many of them. Also, let me know how you guys' runs are going. Where are you guys surviving? I, I appreciate all the comments, but I love hearing about your, uh, your other... <clears throat> I love hearing about your guys' games, too. Dang it. Go down, sir. Thank you. I saw a knife. I did. Nothing. Ay, ay, ay. Very loud vehicles going by today for whatever reason. Oh, oh. This ranger, this ranger, you're getting a little too close. God, you are a tank. Jeez. Ah, oh, it's a cabin, is it? Oh, jeez. Ah. Never ends with these guys. Locked at that. Everything in Muldras locked. There's crap for loot. I hate this place. It's official. God, there's just nothing in here. Yeah. Alright, let's get out of here. At least we checked though nothing ventured nothing gained that's a storage place over there that can't be the same storage that we cleared is it by the construction site no this is something that uh different i doubt that we can get in there without a sledgehammer or at least an axe yeah there's a secure door on that place Ooh, some trailers. These might be pretty good for books. And other loot. When I very first got this game, I survived in a trailer park for like, I don't know, a month or so. And I actually streamed it and I died. <laughs> oh, beef jerky? No, not the watch. 
But yeah, I died. I think it was Riverside. Died on stream. It was hilarious. But uh, I find a lot of good loot in the trailer parks most of the time. Where's that? Yeah, some pocket jerky. Also, I don't want this watch. You know what, actually? Let's just scoff that down right away. We're pretty hungry here. Ooh. There's one of the fire and rescue flamingos too. Why the music? Let's get down to this fire and rescue. Oh God, we're tired. No axe. Legitimately. A lot of times when you find those trucks, they'll have a fire axe in the back. That's probably the key. Um, you know what? I'll just drop all this on the ground real quick. Yeah, that was the key to this. First aid kit. Nah. No gas, engine shot. Dang it. Let's go check out this trailer house over here. Oh, there's a couple of them. And I do not see a whole lot of zombies. <laughs> there will be now. All right, well, time to get out of here. I'm going home. This whole area is screwed now. Speaking of this place sucks, it is also plagued with house alarms. Everything, every, like every other building I open. All right, I'll see you guys probably tomorrow morning. Once, oh God, maybe. Look at all this. Oh my Jesus, good Lord. Okay, I had to get a screeny of that. All right, I need to pop my map. Well, I think I know where I'm at. Now let's pop the map open real quick. Pause. Okay, yeah. I know how I'm going to ditch these guys. So I was just going to... In that part there. But seeing how there's that behind me. Just in case. For whatever reason, I don't make it out of this alive. Just gonna go like this, sneakity snonk, sneak snonk through, and get to my house. There it is. Okay, I think we should be all right. I'm gonna give Heidi a break, let her rest for the night, eat some food, put away my loot, and I'll see you guys in the morning. All right, everybody. We are back. Heidi had some sardinas for breakfast. Now, I didn't hear or see anybody in our area. Okay, yeah, they stopped right here. Let's clear these guys out. Man, this whole sector is going to be screwed now. I just can't catch a break here. Maudra is house alarm city. I don't think I've ever had to deal with this many house alarms. It's been absolutely ridiculous. I kind of just want to go down here and check the damage. And uh, see if maybe the trailer park is still an option. Yeah, they're all kind of wandering back.
I hear something behind me. Yep. Oh god, fighting in the storm. Low visibility. Boy, it is really kicking up now, isn't it? This is dangerous. And the music is epic. Nothing. Yeah, nothing on any of them, huh? Okay. Let's push forward. Oh, jeez. It is like pitch black out here, man. Holy crap. Where am I at on the map? Okay. We are near the trailer park area. All right. So, yeah. It might be hectic from here on out. Let's go sneak mode. Oh, yeah. It's a problem down here, all right. And they're all scattered in these trees. Oh, jeez. It is raining sideways out here. Literally. Yeah, this is very dangerous. I'm not talking much because I'm trying to concentrate on what's around Heidi. Look at this. The screen is black. I mean, does it actually get that dark? Oh, pocket beef jerky. I'll take that. Does it actually get that dark in Knox County when it's storming? I mean, what the hell? Hopefully this lets off a little bit. Just want to see if I can get some books in the trailer park here. Y'all zombies are making it even more difficult. Ah, at least get one. Stop trying to flank me. Oh, oh, yeah, what now? Lead pipe to the dome. Oh my God, that thunder is so loud. Yeah, there could be a zombie right behind me and I wouldn't even know it. No beta blockers. definitely heard something in the trees I just don't know which direction come on go down you lug head there we go Another annotated map we can have a look at. Let's see. March Ridge. I'm <laughs> never going there. Okay. Hell emptied out here. I can agree with that. Extra hardware stuff we can use to secure building. Okay, so we got a couple. The only thing that might even remotely be worth going to March Ridge is the hardware. That place is a complete death trap. I mean, honestly, it's not looking too bad down here. 
Yeah, they probably tore the crap out of that house. Oh, whoa! Directionally challenged Heidi! What are you doing? Go down, you lunkhead! What the hell? Why can't I hit you? Die! Military boots? No, I didn't mean to do that. Something else coming after me. Maybe. I, I can't tell. There's like ambient zombie noises in the storm sounds. I swear. Boy, this is dicey. Can't see two feet in front of me. Thought I saw a hunting knife. I'll take that, ma'am. Oh boy. We got stuff breaking out, breaking in of everywhere. Can this storm please let up? Jiminy Christmas, man. I guess I won't break that window for you. Oh, there he is. <laughs> Come on out, sir. Oh my gosh. And none of y'all have nothing on you. Nothing. I got one, one bit of pocket turkey. Storm of the century down here. Oh my god. Yeah, they tore this place to shreds, didn't they? What was that? I'm checking everywhere in this place before I go inside. Oh yeah, that's a problem over there. Alright, you know what? Oh, dehydrated meat stick. So we got some jerky and a, a stale pepperoni stick. I'm gonna go back home. This storm sucks. I'll reconvene with you guys there. All right, everybody, I've made it home unscathed. Heidi was soaked to the bone. I dried her off with the only dish towel I could find, which is on the floor somewhere now. Anyways, I think that's enough for one episode. I'm gonna ride this storm out, see if maybe I can get some better recording weather. There's that towel. Anyways, smash that like button if you find yourself enjoying, consider subscribing. You are one click away from joining the Fire Nation army and together we will rule the apocalypse of Knox County. Moldra sucks. As always, I'll link another Zomboid playlist up here. Feel free to check them out. And if you're just tuning into this one, go on back to episode one and start from the beginning of Heidi Einvar's journey. As always, have a wonderful day, all you beautiful people out there.